so in this video we will solve the part c of the same question to write down the all the Nash equilibrium so there are various strategies to find the Nash equilibrium it can be best response function strategies in which we will eliminate the strategy of each player which is being dominated by other strategy the best method is to solve the question using the best method response since it will give you all the Nash equilibrium of this games so each player has Each player has four strategies A, B, and C, and D. We will compare the payoffs of each player given the strategy of the other player. So when you starting from player 1, when player 2 who chooses strategy A, player 1 will compare the payoffs of his strategies between these and he will choose the strategy which will give him the highest payoff so out of 1, 2, 3 and 2 strategies he gives him the highest payoff so we will choose this strategy similarly when player 2 plays B we will compare the these payoffs and we will choose the strategy since it gives the highest payoff on the other hand when it chooses C 1 1 minus 1 and 1 these payoffs are same so we will choose all the ones and when it comes to D 3 is higher so we choose the 3 this was the case of the player 1 coming to the player 2 when when the player 1 chooses A, the player 2 will compare his rows payos. So these 2, 0, 3, 2 comparing these, player 2 will choose the strategy C since it gives the highest payoff. Similarly, when it chooses B, player 2 will also choose B since 2 is greater than the minus 1 0 and 0 so when player chooses A player 2 will choose B since 2 is greater than 1 minus 1 and 1 finally when player chooses D player 2 will also choose the strategy of B so we have got same circles here in this box in this box in this box and in this box so these are the four Nash equilibrium of this game which are A and C because player 1 shows the payoffs of the first payoff shows the player of player 1 and the second payoff shows the payoffs of player 2 respectively these are the strategies of each player so this is 2 and 2 this is 3 and 2 and finally 3 and 2 this is how can we find the all the Nash equilibria if we have been given the matrix using the best response function.